welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this video, I'll be installing a wig provided by Sinusure Hair. They gave me a 24 inch transparent lace frontal wig. This is what the wig looks like in its natural state before I pluck or bleach anything. The next clip will show you what it looks like after I bleached and plucked the wig. Before I place the wig on my client's head, I like to have the baby hairs and the hair parted in place already. I left the bleach on the lace for about 30 minutes, but all the knots didn't get bleached, so I used makeup to cover it. When you have the wig on your client's head where you want it to lay, have your client help you hold it so you can cut around the ear. If you look closely, you're going to see a dotted line on my client's forehead. I make that dotted line so I can know exactly where to place the glue. For each install, I use three layers of glue. Once the last layer dries clearly, I place the lace right on top of the glue. When you're placing the lace on top of the glue, you want to make sure that you're dragging the lace all the way down by your client's ear. place the frontal down you're gonna cut the lace off and glue down all the parts that you missed This is what the wig looks like after everything's been glued down. Before I started styling my client's edges, I placed a band on her hairline to let the lace melt for a few minutes. Since I'm doing dramatic baby hairs for this install, I used my curling iron to curl all the edges before swooping them with the mousse.
before I style the baby hairs with the mousse, I use a little bit of gel on each baby hair before I start swooping them. This is what the baby hairs look like after I finish swooping all of them. Now I'm gonna use about four to five wrap strips and tie it down. Now that the baby hairs are completely dried, I'm going to use my bio silk and hot comb my client's hairline. Once you finish hot combing the hairline, you're going to use an angled brush and the makeup that you use to put on the lace and outline the part to make it look sharper.
this is the finished look and i hope you guys enjoyed watching remember to like comment and subscribe thanks for watching